print email Facebook Twitter more Telstra's mobile services back to normal levels after nationwide outage Telstra says its mobile voice and data services have returned to normal levels after another outage crippled its 3G and 4G mobile phone networks across Australia this morning. Network monitoring website AussieOutages.com showed a large number of problems in Brisbane, Sydney, Melbourne, Adelaide, and Perth with other hotspots showing across Australia's population hubs. There were also widespread complaints about Telstra's outage page not working, and NAB and the Commonwealth Bank both said they were aware the problem was impacting FPOS facilities. Several train services in Victoria were cancelled due to communication difficulties, and roadside assistance services said they were also significantly impacted. But the telco said triple zero calls should have been unaffected, with calls connecting over other carriers' networks where available, and it apologized for the inconvenience. Telstra's group managing director of networks Mike Wright said today's outage was not related to earlier impacts, but added the root cause was still unknown. The company responded to customer complaints on Twitter, saying, The issue is impacting some 4G mobile voice and data services nationally, which is also causing congestion for 3G services. We're working to resolve the issue and are investigating the root cause. We're sorry for the inconvenience. At 12.16 p.m. East Telstra said the situation was improving, and just after 2 p.m. said mobile voice and data services have returned to normal levels. We'll closely monitor network stability and performance and continue supporting our customers to restore their services," it added in a statement. We're again deeply sorry for any disruption as we know how customers rely on our mobile services. In a statement, a spokesperson for Communications Minister Mitch Fifield said the Secretary of the Department of Communications had spoken to Telstra Chief Executive Andy Penn seeking further information about the cause of today's outage. One man, Dion Kostakin, said on Twitter he was getting a little tired of this happening and has been for months. The outage comes after a similar incident on May 1, when a nationwide issue prevented thousands of customers from making or receiving calls for several hours. The government is investigating Telstra's triple zero outage on May 4, which saw emergency calls from around the country go unanswered. A spokesperson for Senator Fifield said Telstra had provided an interim report into that outage. Telstra's share price was down another 1.4% to a fresh seven-year low of $2.81 shortly before midday. AEST. Following the outage, people were reporting on Monday morning that only the SOS services were available during the current issue. Print email Facebook Twitter.